Hello and welcome to Ham's Pokemon and today is the release date of Forbidden Light and I have got my hands on a three pack blister but wait, <laughs> I didn't even notice this but it's got a Burning Shadows um, pack in the front let me just check, I do actually have the other one. Oh, they both have it so they're, they're both coming with um, they're both coming with a pack of Burning Shadows, which is really obscure, but two packs of Forbidden Light. Um, not really sure why, a Cernius coin, and this one has Garbdor, and the other one, which I'll open in another video, is the Reggie Giga. So today I'm gonna open the Garbador three pack blister. And like I said, really strange, and the first time I've seen this um, with these new set, with these sets, is that it's actually not gonna have three packs of Forbidden Light. It's coming with a pack of uh, burning shadows with it for some reason. Here is the Garbador, which actually isn't, oops, sorry, which isn't a promo. It is a alternative art from Guardians Rising, but it's still a pretty cool card. Really cool artwork. Very strange. I don't know why they wouldn't just give it a promotional card, but whatever. So here is the coin, a very cool blue Xerneas coin. And the three packs. Well, I'm obviously going to go straight into Burning Shadows to sort of clear that one and then open the two packs of Forbidden Light. So uh, go ahead and enjoy the code for Burning Shadows. Not really sure why they've done that, but they've decided that they don't want to put three packs of Forbidden Light out for some reason or another. Okay, so Noctowl, Electabuzz, Mount Lanakila, Esper, Pikachu, Noibat, Dupider, Tangela, Reverse is a Wobbuffet Uncommon, and Alolan Ninetales, Regular Rare. Unfortunately, I saw the green card go and knew that there would be nothing in it because Ben and Shadows and back, whenever you, and sorry, Crimson Invasion 2 and back, any time you said a green code, obviously you weren't going to get anything. So, on to the two packs that I think most people will be the most interested in are the Forbidden Light packs. So, uh, here is the card code. And of course, there are Prism Stars in this collection. So exciting to have the possibility of getting one of those in here, even if it is a green card code. So here we go. The first look past the pre-release site I got, the first packs on the first day, is a Point Ball, a Howlucha, a Unit Energy, Noibat, Execute, Honage, Bunnelby, Esper. Reverse is a rare Tyrantrum, which is excellent. What a cool card that is. Look at the really cool artwork there. And a Heatran. Heatran? <laughs> I pulled so many Heatrans in the, uh, in the last collection that it's kind of common to see another one. This time a fire type. So, second and final pack, which is, like I said, is seems a little strange when you buy a three-pack blister for it to not all be, um, to not all be Forbidden Light, but that's okay, if that's their new system. Probably trying to offload some of the Burning Shadows, I suppose. So, here we go, another Point Bomb, which is really funny because I watched a friend's channel, um, Mr. Tauros, and he, and he really wanted to get some Poipoles. And um, he only got one from four packs and I, or no, he, he opened a lot of packs. I can't remember how many it was, but I, I've already got two from two. Crash Awake and an Azelf. That's cool. Pokemon I don't know much about. Dupider, Gumi, Scatterbug, a Bergmite, a Pancham, the reverse, is an uncommon judge. There are some good trainers in this collection worth some money. And the rare is... Oh, a Torterra regular rare. So, just the one reverse from the two packs. It's not terrible. Could have been worse. Could have got nothing. So, thanks a lot, guys, for popping by. I hope you please like, comment, subscribe. I uh, will be opening the second blister within uh, the coming days. So, thanks a lot for popping on by.